Hi friends, uh, my name is Dean Malpal and so today's topic is uh, why people have extramarital affairs during these days. So people all around uh, are having extramarital affairs regardless of their um, socio-economic background uh, or locations. Some instances uh, come, some instance come as a shock uh, because when things seems to be going well in the marriage, you can't help but wonder. So, uh, something obviously went wrong somewhere. Um, where are some possible reasons as to why people indulge uh, in an extramarital affairs? Now, for example, there is some reason behind this. Uh, first point is, uh, first point uh, for extramarital is uh, early marriage. So uh, people who marry in their early 20s would most likely have achieved some level of stability and social standing by their mid-30s. At that point, they feel that they did not really enjoy their life in their 20s and find it exciting indulge uh, indulge is an extramarital affairs it is their way of experiencing the thrill and excitement of and uh, my second point for extramarital affairs is uh, married for the wrong reason married for the wrong reasons so many people enter into marriage for the wrong reasons. Pressures from the family and society top the least in the country. After a point, many people agree to uh, manage, agree to marriage without uh, even getting to know their life partner. Once the deed is done, they realize the mistakes. Uh, they realize the mistakes they have made in terms of the choice of their life partner. So if they meet someone who is uh, in many ways is a better match than their current spouse, they are immediately attracted to him or her. And uh, what starts as a simple friendship usually ends up uh, in... Um, and uh, my third point for the extramarital affair is inability to deal with changes. So life throws changes at us almost every day. Most of us uh, are able to deal with the small changes, uh, but the bigger ones are together to deal with. A serious illness in the family, death, loss of employment, financial losses, etc. So many turn to people apart from their spouses to deal with such changes. They find more uh, they find more comfort as you say in the forms in the arms of their um, in the arms of someone new perhaps uh, someone not connected to their tough circumstances in any way. Uh, my next point for the extramarital affairs is the physical dissatisfactions which is most extremely important for the uh, reason. So th this is probably uh, one of the most common um, reasons for the people uh, to get uh, involved is an extramarital affair. Emotional disconnection. So uh, sometimes a couple, sometimes a couple grows uh, emotionally uh, disconnected from each other. The top reasons being lack of times and lack of communications, uh, which each others to be emotionally connected uh, you need to share mm, you need to talk you need to express you need to listen you need to love you need to care and show that you care so if you do not do this over a period of time changes you will get emotionally disconnected from each other as a couple and start getting uh, emotionally connected with some else. What starts as an emotional bond with someone can eventually 
my next point for the uh, extramarital affair is uh, this agreement or core values. Sometimes when you experience a tough situations in life, your core values are tested and you have to make uh, decisions uh, which may not be uh, palatable to your family, especially your spouse. Sometimes this could be the cause for in um, you can say uh, cause for uh, uh, my next point for the um, extra matter affair is uh, differencing or differing life priorities so when a couple get married uh, often they do not speak about life priorities first of all simply because it is so important or uh, people are not so clear about their life with time the priorities start getting clear and more pronounced and increasingly uh, divergent what you can say over time this become uh, this become so different that it becomes tough to live together and agree on even basic things on a daily basis this can be a um, catalyst my next point for the extra matter affair is uh, no common interests uh, relate the both person mm. so if you have nothing in common within each with each other you will eventually get absorbed in pursuing uh, your own diver uh, divergent interests in life you will end up not spending enough time together as you spend time away from each other and you get opportunities to in uh, to uh, interact with others and gradually start building a bond with those who share your interests many times this leads to an extramarital affairs also my next point for the extramarital affair is um, need for excitement in life so sometimes it is sheer boredom uh, or a need to break the monotony and drug agency for everyday life that is the reason for an extramarital affair just for fun just for a change in life or some excitement in life you need and the next point is very important personal finances so difficulties in personal finances uh, you can say excess debts in life and liabilities in life uh, which may be the main cause uh, for extramarital affairs or lack of agreement on on personal financial management can sometimes be that uh, be the trigger you can say for constant um, bickering within the four walls where the both people is live and at a, a vulnerable time anyone who gives a hearing to your oaths or some financial support is welcome and this can lead to an extramarital affair also my next point is which is foremost expert important for the reason behind this for the extramarital affair so career advan advancement uh, said but true some people get into a relationship uh, simply because they believe it can advance their career while these are the broad reason usually it is a combination of many um, of these which drives people into an extramarital affair all said and done it is tough to see a couple go through the stress of an extramarital affair relationships in life are broken children are affected by their behavior and they could be life long issues um, 
with guilt and trust uh, and uh, it's not an easy situations for anyone Play, play, make it.